Welcome to the Facts Box TV. Which is the best main battle tank in the world? Which is the greatest modern MBT and why? Our top 5 analysis is based on the combined score of protection, firepower, accuracy and mobility. None of the tanks listed here have seen combat against each other during military operations yet. And even though some things, such as armor composition, are kept in high secrecy, we know a lot about these machines. Data on their protection, firing range, accuracy, capabilities of their fire control systems, and so on are widely available. So we know capabilities of each of these tanks. This analysis is based on specifications and available data. All of the tanks mentioned here are incredibly powerful and devastating. However crew training at the tank is also an important factor, as performance of the actual tank depends from the crew performance. This list do not contains tanks that are currently under development, at the prototype stage or tanks that never reach production. The only exception here is the Russian Armada which was produced in small numbers for testing and evaluation, but is not yet produced in quantity. What do you think that which tank is better? Let us know in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so that you can watch more videos like this. Now let's get started. Number 5. T-14 Armada. The T-14 Armada is a new Russian main battle tank of new generation. It was first publicly revealed in 2015. A small batch of these tanks were built. Its full-scale production could begin in 2020-2021. The Armada is a clean sheet design with a number of advanced features. It shares little common with the current T-90. Also the Armada is much bigger than its predecessor. Its specifications are classified, however the Armada might be one of the most protected tanks in the world. It has newly developed base armor, made of steel, ceramics and composite materials. Also Armada has a new Malakit add-on explosive reactive armor. It has been reported that Armada will be fitted with a new Afghan active protection system that is currently being developed. However in 2018 it appeared that there are setbacks with development of the Afghanit. By 2018 prototypes of the system were not completed and were not ready for testing. The tank has a new countermeasure system that reduces the chance of being hit by enemy ADGM with semi-automatic guidance. This tank is operated by a crew of three men. All crew members are seated side by side and well protected in at the front of the hull. It is the first production MBT with such crew layout. The tank can operate even with penetrated armor, as far as the crew cell is intact. The Armada is also a world's first production MBT with completely unmanned turret. It is armed with a new 125mm smoothbore gun that is more accurate than the previous Russian tank guns. This tank can launch anti-tank guided missiles in the same manner as ordinary projectiles. The gun is completed with an auto-loader. This tank has a hunter-killer capability. Introduction of this new Russian MBT created is Tur in the West. Now a number of countries, such as Germany and UK are looking to upgrade their tanks or develop new designs in order to counter the threat posed by this new Russian tank. Number 4. Challenger 2. It is a very capable tank. The Challenger 2 has the latest Shabham armor and is one of the most protective MBTs in the world today. It offers very high level of protection against direct fire weapons. This British tank is armed with a very accurate 120mm rifled gun. Its gun is rifled as opposed to smoothbore guns used by all other modern MBTs. Its maximum aimed range is over 5 km. Currently the Challenger holds the record 4 for longest tank 2 tank kill. Engine of the Challenger 2 is less powerful than of its western rivals. Also it is not as fast as other MBTs. However this tank is famous for its mechanical reliability. The Challenger 2 is in service with the United Kingdom and Oman. Number 3. m 2 Sep. The m 2 Sep is a successor to the m 2 Abrams. This tank has incredible technology and armor. 
Also it has seen combat. It is one of the most feared MBTs. The M1A2 set offers significant protection against all well-known anti-tank weapons. This main battle tank uses advanced armor, reinforced with depleted uranium layers. Its firepower and accuracy are slightly inferior to that of the Leopard 2A7 or the South Korean K2 Black Panther due to a shorter 120mm smooth bore gun. Yet it still packs a formidable punch. Its complex gas turbine engine offers good performance, but requires tremendous amount of maintenance, logistical support and is thirsty on fuel. A number of older M1, M1A1 and M1A2 tanks were upgraded to this standard. The tank can be also fitted with a tank urban survival kit that improves survivability in urban environment. To date very few Abrams tanks have been destroyed in combat. The M1 A2 sub is in service with the United States Army. It is planned that this tank will remain in service beyond 2050. The M1 A2 sub has not been exported yet. However the previous M1 A2 has been supplied to Kuwait and Saudi Arabia. Number 2. K2 Black Panther. Currently the Black Panther is one of the most advanced main battle tank in the world, outclassing anything North Korea or China have. Furthermore it is the most expensive main battle tank to date. Deliveries of the K-2 Black Panther tank commenced to the South Korean Army in 2016. As of 2017 at least 100 tanks were delivered. South Korean requirement is for around 300 of these new tanks. These will eventually replace the older K-1 tanks. This tank uses composite armor of undisclosed type and explosive reactive armor modules. It is claimed that front armor withstands direct hits from 120mm tank rounds, fired from L-55 guns. Its protection level is broadly similar to that of the M-102 Abrams, considering that the K-2 is much lighter. The Black Panther tank is also completed with an active protection system and countermeasure system that further increase its survivability on the battlefield. This new South Korean tank is armed with the latest German 120mm L55 gun, similar to that used on the German Leopard 2A6 and 2A7. This tank has a very advanced fire control system with can spot, track and fire automatically at visible vehicle size targets, and even low-flying helicopters, without needing any input from a human operator. The K-2 also uses advanced munitions. The Black Panther is fitted with a powerful diesel engine. It is fast and has a state-of-the-art hydropneumatic suspension. Number 1. Leopard 2 A7. It is a recent version of the proven and successful Leopard 2 design. It has additional armor and updated electronics. The Leopard 2 A7 is well protected against conventional and urban warfare threats, such as RPG rounds and IEDs. This tank has better accuracy and longer range of fire comparing with other tanks due to its powerful gun and advanced fire control system. During numerous international tank challenge competitions the Leopard 2 series tanks outperformed American M1 A2 SEP, British Challenger 2, French Leclerc and some other tanks in terms of overall performance. Despite the increase in weight vehicle has increased mobility due to improved suspension components. Cross-country performance is similar to other Leopard 2 series tanks. German Army ordered the first batch of 20 Leopard 2A7 MBTs, upgraded from Leopard 2A6. Deliveries commenced in 2014. German Army plans to upgrade 50 to 150 tanks to the 2A7 standard. Qatar ordered 62 of these MBTs and Saudi Arabia more than 200. Thanks for watching, and as always don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.